season's greetings, little beans. Warning, the following ASMR is only aimed for beans who are in the need for comfort and positive energy from a favorite cartoon character. There won't be any NSFW versions of this ASMR. This is for all ages and it's appropriate for all. However, if you feel uncomfortable from videos like this, and click off. To the ones who are staying, go right ahead and get all cozy in your blinkies, pop in your headphones, snack on some pockies, and enjoy this ASMR. See you later, uncles. Uh, just don't scare too many people. <laughs> uh, just have fun. Mm-hmm. Oh, don't worry. I'll just leave the house just how it is. <laughs> Ah, <sighs> finally they're gone. I can finally clean this house up. <sighs> well, looks like I'll get started on the trash then. Hmm, good thing Uncle Fatso didn't make a big mess this time. And stretchy, and stinky. Hmm, I'll just clean it up. <sighs> okay, now it's just getting heavy. <laughs> if I was alive... I don't know if I can weigh a lot. Mm. Maybe for a second life. <sighs> there we go. Mostly got out the the smell. Now we just have to wait if the garbage truck comes. I'll just leave it here. Now I'll get started on uh Hey. Is that a human over there? I wonder what they're doing over Hmm. Maybe they're lost? Or... exploring? At the middle of the night? Hmm. Maybe I can try talking to them. Hopefully they don't scream. Hi! I'm Casper! Uh... Uh... uh please, 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 don't scream. Don't worry. I don't scare people. I'm a very friendly ghost. Um... <laughs> Please don't run away or scream because, uh, you know, people might hear us. Yeah, I am real. Hey, why are you touching... Uh, <laughs> we ghosts can be really cold, yeah. Because, <laughs> uh, we're dead. <laughs> uh, what are you doing here? You came to do some exploring around here? Well, that's my home. I live with my three uncles. They're just out scaring people. It's kind of a job for them. I guess scaring people is kind of a job for us, for the unliving. <laughs> Why don't I scare people? I'm too friendly. Let's just say I was raised very well. <laughs> yeah. Oh? You're a paranormal investigator? Hmm, I think I've heard of those before. Those are people that, um, get fascinated by the paranormal. And they want to invest whether or not they're real or not. Am I right? Oh, okay, I got that right. Well, you're seeing one now. <laughs> Maybe I can give you a tour around my house. Don't worry, my uncles are gone. Um... I'm actually cleaning it up because, uh, my uncles attempt to be very, uh, messy. Yeah, come on in. I can patch you up some food. Mm-hmm. Again, just don't mind the mess. And the cobwebs. I should really do some cleaning even though they told me not to clean. Yeah, it's supposed to be a haunted house. But I like to organize things. Come on in. Oh, <laughs> I guess you're so full of questions. Um, hold on. Let me get you some snacks. Uh, let's see. Hmm, let's see. Ooh, that's expired. Uh, this is also expired. Ooh, here we go. Best Buy. Okay, um, do you like fruit cocktail? Okay, let me just open it up and see if I have any silverware. Ah, here we go. Here. I just got it. I just found it, and, uh, I guess still good. 
Uh, let's head to my room. It's more comfortable up there. Just don't mind the toys. Yeah, follow me. Well, of course I can go through. I'm a ghost. Well, technically I find it really impolite. But, uh, my uncles told me to do it because I'm a ghost. Oh, don't worry. It's, it's unlocked. Come on in. <laughs> you may sit down and just look around. I hope you like the cocktail. Well, fruit cocktail. <laughs> so, you wanted to ask me questions? Kind of like what a paranormal investigation inv invader does? <laughs> Sorry, it's just, it seems like a new word for me to say. I'm not really used to seeing those people, usually. There would be kids walking in, and I accidentally scare them. There's sometimes adults and teenagers. Just wanted to see if whether or not we're real, and, uh, yeah, we do tend to scare them. Oh, <laughs> okay, um, I guess you're gonna tell people about this, or no? Okay, thank you for, um, accepting, you know, my invasion of privacy and keeping it to yourself. <laughs> don't worry, I'm very friendly, but I don't mind you bringing it out to the world because we do indeed exist. Mm-hmm. I don't mind at all. <laughs> Alright, go ahead and ask me anything. Well, my name is Casper, like I said. Um, well, I, I'm a ghost. I'm really friendly. I really enjoy, um, hanging out with my uncles. Uh, their names are Stretchy, Fatso, and Stinky. They like to scare people because it's their job, but for me, I like to make new friends and cleaning up, and I really enjoy animals. Sometimes I see crows, cats, and some creepy crawlies, too. Usually cats are afraid of me, but black cats, they're my personal favorite. And, uh, let's see. Uh, I am a child. Just letting you know. Um, how old I was when I died? Uh, I think I was 12? Is what I remembered? Yeah, I died when I was 12. How did I die? Hmm. I never thought someone would like to know how I died. Hmm. Just give me a second. I do remember how. And... One of my uncles told me that I died from pneumonia. They told me I couldn't play outside because due to the weather. And I pretty much didn't listen, so I played in the cold, and I developed pneumonia, and they tried to help me get better, but it just got worse for me, so yeah, that's how I died. Yeah. What did it feel like? felt like my life was flashing into my eyes when I was little, my first birthday, even the day of my birth, too. All flashing through my eyes. My heart would stop when it's at the end, letting out my last breath, my last heartbeat, everything gone away. The light hit me. It's like I woke up feeling light and free. It makes me forget about everything. <laughs> I don't know why I would remember, but it's been so long. Mm-hmm. My uncles say that ghost, when you're a ghost for a very long time, you attempt to forget your past life when you were alive. 
Because it doesn't matter anymore. Now that you're a ghost. It doesn't matter to you and just move on. I'm free now. Even though it's really hard to make new friends. Because, you know, I'm a ghost. It's not easy being that different. Because nobody really likes different. Because it's too weird for them. I feel like I'm just made to not have friends. At all. Huh? You want to be my friend? Even though I'm a ghost and you're a human? <laughs> really? You want to be my friend? <laughs> Thank you! Uh, what's your name again? I, uh, I'm so sorry. I didn't really get your name earlier. But... Care to tell me? Listener. <laughs> That's a very lovely name. So... <laughs> I guess for my answer... I would love to be your friend, listener, even though that I'm a ghost, but I promise I won't scare you, and I would like to get to know you more. Mm hmm But maybe where my uncles aren't around here because they will attempt to scare you. It's for your safety. And plus, <laughs> you just made my ghost life more happier, and more useful. You're probably the first person that's become my friend ever since, you know. <laughs> <laughs> of course we can hug, even though you may not feel me, but yeah. Sorry if I'm really that cold. Again, I'm a ghost. We're pretty cold. So, do you got any more questions for me? Huh? Oh, that must be my uncle's. I'm sorry, I didn't expect them to come back soon. How about we meet each other again? Yeah, um, maybe someplace else. How about at the cemetery? There's usually not a lot of people at night. Yeah, I promise. I'll be there. I might have to give you a little, uh, boo. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh, well, you gotta go now. My uncles are gonna be here and possibly scare you. So you may have to make a run for it. <gasps> okay, okay, now you really gotta go. Go! I'll see you tomorrow at the cemetery! <laughs> Bye! Oh, man. Hopefully they'll never get mad at me for throwing out the trash. Hey, uncles! <laughs>